Hello again guys and welcome to my complete walkthrough of how to root, unlock your bootloader, install a custom kernel and a custom ROM to your phone. To kick things up we're gonna go to your browser and then to xdadevelopers.com right here you're gonna type to find your device you type x8 so you're in Sony Xperia x8 forums so you enter themes and apps forum and you download something called flash tool you go into the flash tool forum into the flash tool home page So you basically download the application which is an application that will allow you to do anything you want to do with your phone such as root it, clean it or install a custom kernel. So once you reach the flash tool home page you will go ahead and tap on installation right here then you will choose your operating system and download your application once you have downloaded the application you simply install it and then open it once you open the application you are confronted with the application central menu now, you see that right now it says device disconnected so the first thing you're going to do is to simply connect your device with your PC via USB cable which I'm going to do right now and you see that it says connected device E15 so it's Xperia X8 and right now it says root access allowed so it won't say that to you and what you're going to do is go to this icon right here and press it and simply follow the instructions then you reboot your phone and it is rooted the next step is to go under the plugins and choose bootloader unlock in that way you will unlock your bootloader with four to five basic steps it's really simple now for those of you who want to keep the stock kernel of your device but install a custom recovery you simply tap on the plus icon and install a custom recovery but if you want to install a custom kernel all you need to do is go to XDA developers again and download an FTF file from the original Android development for X8 so you see you go into a channel forum such as NAA Jellybean 05 you download the FTF file and once you have downloaded it you move it to your computer local disk flash tool firmware so you move it right here you see all of these are kernels so it's really important you move it here otherwise your application won't recognize it then you turn off your phone you disconnect it from your computer press on the lightning icon choose a kernel such as na 14 and follow the instructions it's fairly simple so I think that's all for now if you like this video 
please feel free to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and reviews. Until next time, bye bye.